Ryanair have reported an incident on one of their planes to police after a video was shared thousands of times on social media. The video, taken on board a flight from Barcelona to Stansted, shows a man racially abusing an elderly black woman. The woman's daughter says the incident has left her very depressed and the airline has been criticised for not removing the man from the plane. Here's a short excerpt from the video. I'll tell you this. If you don't go to another seat, I'll push you to another seat. Hey, stop. Alright, we'll carry on. There's no other can with this. Hey, keep your voice down. Stop. There's no need for that at all. Just stop. It's really easy. It's not easy now. You have to move this lady. Move this lady. Stop. You have to move. Stop. Well, throw him off the throw him off the flight. Throw him off the flight. Well, eventually the lady was moved to another seat. Owen Curry, editor of Travel Extra, is on the line. Owen, oh, a significant number of people, including I've noticed several politicians, have asked why the man wasn't removed from the flight. Is there any protocol for dealing with this sort of thing? Oh yes, there is, Rachel. It's a very very simple one. There's a very clear chain of command. Uh, Once uh, you get on an aircraft, it is not Ryanair management who are in charge, it's the captain. The captain makes uh, his judgment on taking into account lots of things, including the inconvenience to other passengers. That isn't just when there's noise or abuse or anything. It's also if a flight is delayed or diverted, it can uh, cause chaos, cause a lot of trouble in people's lives. So what tends to happen in situations, and it's it's a huge problem, it's a growing problem, um, a lot of uh, incidents related to drink, particularly, and uh, abuse flying around uh, within the, the the cabin of an aircraft. Uh, the crew uh, go to the captain. It, he's, it doesn't matter who's on the flight, if Ryanair management are on the flight, he's the one who will decide, taking everything into consideration, what's the best course of action. And it's usually, once a passenger is on an aircraft, um, it causes so many, so much trouble with delays, l- luggage, everything like that. It's the last resort. And yet this man's behaviour was so threatening and so offensive. Um, are staff trained to deal with this sort of thing? It, it, crew are trained to deal with, uh, com- with conflict, uh, but the situation can change. Every, the, the situations they have to deal with can vary enormously. And uh, it has to be said that crew themselves have been subject to a greater level of abuse over the last two or three years. Uh, some of the flights that, particularly to the party destinations, uh, crew have um, put up put up with quite a deal of um, bickering among passengers. Occasionally, um, there have been fights which have caused plane uh, aircraft to be diverted. A large number of these, the greatest proportion in Ryanair's network, and remember Ryanair's three big markets are Italy, Spain and UK, but the largest proportion of flights that have had this sort of, um, these sort of situations and others have been shared on social media have been ex-UK. Uh, it's been commented on by the management. You've heard calls that alcohol not be served in airports from Ryanair. And it is something that is taken very, very seriously um, by all airlines that once their crew are put in the, uh, in any situation where they're abused and, and are dangerous, and once the comfort of their passengers is threatened by a passenger, they do take a serious view. They then have to... The, the, the captain is the one who will actually decide. It isn't something that passengers on board an aircraft can decide that somebody's been excessively abusive. We, we, he should be thrown off. It always comes back to a very simple chain of command, which goes back to the old shipping days. All right, Owen, thanks indeed for joining us this morning. Owen Corrie there of Travel Extra and his chance would have it. Ryanair's figures for the first half of the year are out this morning.